Huge Clues Sister Wives is over after season 19. Hello guys, I am Sabrina. To you, welcome back to my channel. Please subscribe the channel and press bell icon for latest news updates. Recently, huge clues have been spotted that Sister Wives season 19 might be the last one for the Brown family. Undeniably, the Browns have undergone significant changes over the past few years, with former wives, Mary, Janelle, and Christine Brown, all going their separate ways, the kids growing up, and the union broken, will they be going through a season 20? Sister Wives Season 19 Promises Excitement Although Sister Wives Season 19 appears ready to dish on explosive interactions between the former wives, Mary, Janelle and Christine, with Cody and Robin Brown, will they be quitting the series guns blazing? Undeniably, the Brown family is in a different place than ever before. With three wives leaving the plural marriage and the tragic loss of Garrison Brown, they are all transitioning. Each of the former wives has already moved on and established new lives away from Cody and Robin Brown, but some huge clues show that the end of the show may be on the horizon. Huge Clues Sister Wives is over after season 19. Just days ago, fans noticed that Cody and Robin Brown have listed their Flagstaff mansion for sale. Likewise, there have been huge family events that make people believe TLC may see the writing on the wall that it is time to quit. On Reddit, Sister Wives fans discuss some significant clues that season 19 may be the end of the long-running series. First, a viewer says, show over. Then they follow it up with, who thinks that K&R might be selling the house and getting the heck out of Dodge because the show is over after the next season? I mean, the OG3 have all moved to different states and if they had another season, it would be all about Garrison's death. I can see the others calling it done instead of doing that. After the initial post, several other viewers weighed in. I think it's over. Cody and Janelle's son just died and they have other things on their mind is my guess. The show is so far behind their current reality. I hope it's over for Sister Wives, the show as I will not watch. Maybe ex-Sister Wives I might watch, not Cody nor Robin, ever. First, we need to rule out Dayton moving to the same place they did. If Robin did not follow him again, that opens up several other possibilities. Some Sister Wives fans have conditions for continuation. However, some Sister Wives viewers say there are a few conditions that would keep them engaged in another season. I would think it would be way too expensive to have film crews at four different locations full-time, but if they show another season of K&R going bankrupt, I'll watch. That would be must-see TV. Whatever they do, Cody better make sure he can keep Robin covered in ugly floral blouses and QVC deliveries, or she will roll out on him and clean out what's left in his pockets. Maybe I'm a terrible person, but I'm here for the skate and fraud. I'd love to see K-plus-R so desperate for money that they keep filming their financial and relational troubles. I probably need to go to therapy. Cody and Robin Brown give foretelling sign it is over. Many people believe seeing Cody and Robin Brown forfeit their coveted mansion is a huge clue sister wives may not be renewed for future seasons. Christine and Janelle and their kids all get together a lot so that could cut down on the expense there and how far apart are Mary and Christine? Tuh, I reckon K and R are selling because they're either in financial trouble or their mortgage is up. Maybe even a bit of both. If they've been in Flagstaff seven years, they must have been in that house about five years' time for the fixed mortgage to expire. Same as the Vegas houses. Wow, you are so right, Ab fixed mortgages. Plus, don't forget mortgage insurance increase. Mine went up almost $4,000 a year, but with good credit, was able to change insurances. I know K and R credit is most likely crap. Now I can see them really needing to get out. They're probably selling because financial wizard Cody thinks it's peak time to sell and they'll make a killing. Kind of like they did with the Vegas houses. I'm sure he also thinks the future buyers will want to purchase all the fancy artwork and decor, as well because K and R have such expensive exquisite taste. Is Garrison Brown's death the end? Recently, my Kelty Brown Padron voiced how upset she is about Garrison Brown's passing being included in Sister Wives Season 19. However, some fans believe it may be necessary to tie it in if there isn't a Season 20. Others think the show will go on even with the controversy of spotlighting Garrison's death. Since many of the family members use the TLC funds to survive, they will continue to air the show as long as viewers tune in. 
Some fans will continue to watch in hopes of seeing Cody and Robin Brown take their true penance. Flagstaff was always more expensive than Vegas. Cody knew that from the beginning. I doubt they'll do an entire season about Garrison or at least I hope not for the sake of the OG-13 siblings and the OG-3 and other Brown family members. Likewise, some people want to see the former wives get justice. I believe E they are selling because they owe Janelle and Mary big time and it's time to pay up. K and R owe Janelle and Mary, who each gave half of their home sale from Las Vegas, so they can buy the McMansion. How frustrating that after all this, Cody was trying to get Mary in a barn dominium or have her stay in Janelle's RV lol. However, sister wives did Aurora Brown move out of Cody and Robbins? Now that sister wives stars Cody and Robin Brown are selling their home, what will happen to the adult children who live with them? Most Sister Wives fans recall that Robin's three children from her previous marriage are all adults now. However, they still live at home with her and Cody. It's tough to say what they will do when the family moves again, but at least a few think Aurora Brown has moved out. A Sister Wives fan isn't sure Aurora still lives with her parents. As the Brown family children grow up, it stands to reason they'd want their own privacy in place of their own, but Robin's kids always seem content to stay home instead. Now that Cody and Robin have put their home on the market, one fan believed they found evidence to support Aurora might have moved out. While perusing the real estate listing for Robin's failed art gallery, I couldn't help but notice that one of the bedrooms appears to be unoccupied, one Reddit user shared online recently. I saw the tacky purple primary room, presumably occupied by K&R, I saw two bedrooms that appeared to belong to a young girl and a young boy, so presumably Saul and Ari. There was a fourth bedroom that had a lot of plants and knickknacks and appeared to be occupied, but it really didn't feel like the bedroom of a young woman. Maybe it was Brianna. Ick, it didn't have any character. The fifth bedroom was totally sparse and looked like a guest room. Pretty sure the plant room is Aurora's. Another Reddit user chimed in. She is really into plants, per her Pinterest board. To me, the entire lower level of the house looked pretty empty. Saul's room had a lot of action figures, but not much else. The most full area of the house was Robin's section of the closet lol. Update. Based on the comments, it looks like the plant room belongs to Aurora, but I'm horrified it has no window treatments to provide privacy for a young woman. The OP updated the post. There's still not a lot of public information about Cody and Robin's move, so it's not immediately clear if the adult children plan to move along with them. Will Robin's kids play any role in season 19? The new season of Sister Wives is just a few weeks out. Robin's children had more screen time last year, but it's not known if they will have any sort of role in the new season. However, is David Jessup, the ex-husband of Robin Brown, still alive? Sister Wives fans know that Robin Brown was married before she married Cody Brown and quickly ensured he adopted her three children, David Dayton Jessup, Aurora, and Brianna. Their dad, David Jessup, later became very ill with cancer. TLC fans discovered things about David Jessup. Sister Wives fans became curious about David Jessup because although he never appeared on the TLC show, his ex-wife made out that he was a terrible man. Word did the rounds that he was abusive. However, there were also stories that she already knew about Cody Brown. These days, many fans are convinced that she dumped her ex because she wanted in on some television fame. Digging around, it turned out that Robin Brown had been married to a man who was actually related to her new husband, Cody Brown. Strange but true, it was discussed on Reddit at great length in 2022. It turned out that David Jessup was Cody's third cousin. Plus, he is related to Christine's side of the family. So that made fans think that Robin made a deliberate play for David's relative. The ex of Robin Brown is still alive. David Jessup became ill and a GoFundMe went up which was run by his sister-in-law, Justa Jessup. The first news noted that he went for an eye appointment and out of that, further investigations revealed he had chronic myeloid leukemia. Treatment didn't work very well, and the bad news filtered back to Sister Wives fans. But this month, more news arrived in an update. The ex-husband of Robin Brown is still alive, and the new update seemed very positive. When Redditor U slash Conversationable 2706 found out, they shared the news with other TLC fans. Citing the updated GoFundMe, the Sister Wives fan said, 
I happened across David's GFM again yesterday. I was happy to see that he is currently somewhat stable and doing well. He just updated about a week ago. It was good to see that his blood work slash numbers look good, and the chemo regimen he is on seems to be doing its job. TLC fans seemed thrilled for David. Fans of Sister Wives seemed to be very happy about the good news for the man who used to be married to Robin Brown and seemed to lose contact with his children. However, Sister Wives Cody and Robin Brown list Arizona House for sale. The polygamous patriarch, Cody Brown, has surprised Sister Wives fans by selling his Arizona house. With season 19 about to premiere, fans are left wondering how Cody's last marriage to Robin Brown is going. With a price tag of $1,650,000, Cody might be ready to start a new life in Utah. Step inside the Brown compound. Robin and Cody are more than ready to walk away from their home, which viewers have seen them make into a mini compound. The house was put on the market via Zillow on August 29. The listing describes the master bedroom as a luxurious, spa-like end-suite bathroom, complete with a large dual-head shower and built-in shelving in the walk-in closet. The primary bedroom has been decorated with a purple theme and includes pictures of nature on the wall. The home also has a large kitchen, which was used as Brown's filming location. The listing notes, the heart of the home is the huge kitchen equipped with a six-burner cooktop and a double oven, a commercial-size refrigerator slash freezer, and a walk-in pantry with space for an additional fridge. This Arizona home also has a game room, two laundry rooms, and an extra-wide garage. The home is 4,476 square feet, and some with five bedrooms and four bathrooms. Perhaps the best selling point is that the home lies just meters from a national forest. The home has an open floor plan and seamlessly connects each room to the other. Along with a heated driveway to welcome you home, the backyard, featuring newly added turf, provides a low maintenance outdoor space perfect for relaxation and play. The home has already been on the market for two days, but there are no bids yet, Neither Cody nor Robin have shared why they have decided to sell their beloved home, but hopefully, the new season answers viewers' questions. However, Sister Wives S19 E1 Preview Cody Tanks faces ex-wives for first time since Split Sister Wives has Cody Brown not dealing with issues very nicely because the household comes collectively for an occasion within the first episode of season 19 of the TLC collection. Followers solely want to attend two extra weeks earlier than episode one, a home divided cannot stand hits the display screen. Cody is slapped together with his new actuality when he sees his competitors from throughout the room at this household affair. Don't overlook, this episode was filmed when Christine Brown began relationship David Woolley. He's the person she is married to at the moment. However, she wasn't once they filmed this social gathering for the brand new season and Cody didn't assume they might final. Sister Wives, Cody Brown Catches Glad Faces Cody Brown stated good riddance to Christine Brown in many various methods. However, followers thought it was his ego speaking. They assumed he by no means wished her to go away within the first place. So once they all come collectively for my Kelty Brown Padron's child sprinkle, Cody turns into uncomfortable whereas wanting across the room. Earlier than the occasion begins, he presents a snarky comment into the Sister Wives Digicum. He is aware of he's about to fulfill Christine's new boyfriend. So, he sarcastically mentions it as if he begrudges this pending meet and greet. We should always bear in mind how a lot Cody harmed Christine by saying merciless issues about her in the previous few seasons. So that is her time to shine. She is fascinating, regardless of Cody claiming she's not. And that's doubtless the message she makes an attempt to get throughout. So Sister Wives followers will get a gander at a proud Christine Brown with David Woolley on her arm. It seems she pours on the pleased scenes, which doubtless sours the occasion for her ex Cody. Cody Not Missed by Janelle Brown Janelle Brown is the spouse who Cody Brown wished to maintain, however she determined towards that. Followers assume Janelle's income's energy performed into the once shared husband's ideas on protecting this spouse. However, Sister Wives followers see Janelle Brown as somebody who may do significantly better than Cody Brown, so it doesn't matter what he deliberate for her when attempting to get her to alter her thoughts, followers couldn't be happier that Janelle caught to her weapons on this one. 
Nonetheless, Cody bravely joins the household at this occasion, however, he sees the happiness his ex-wives appear to have harnessed since leaving him. That's doubtless why the sister-wives patriarch seems wounded. So when season 19 rolls out, you see Janelle wanting into the digicum and saying she doesn't miss him. However, Christine does one even higher. She goes into motion together with her new man and demonstrates her happiness. And the Sister Wives' newest previews recommend this appears like it's an excessive amount of for Cody Brown to soak up. Sister Wives, Papa Brown Eyes David Woolley. Cody makes a snarky comment into the Sister Wives' digicum earlier than he sees Christine and her new beau. With a sarcastic tone, he stated he would get to fulfill her new boyfriend. But it surely was simple to see. It wasn't an occasion he was chomping on the bid to expertise. Nonetheless, he does it. However, did he prefer it? In all probability not, indicated by the look on his face. So when the primary episode of Sister Wives season 19 rolls out, the change within the household dynamics is drastic. But it surely seems like that change left three ex-wives as pleased campers and their ex-hubby considerably depressing. That stated, it looks as if his exes rise on the happiness scale. However, Cody goes within the different route and tanks. From what the TLC collection previews recommend, when the brand new season rolls out in two weeks, it's Cody Brown towards the world he as soon as knew. Now he's wanting considerably lonely, with three out of four wives not flanking his facet, and the one spouse left standing states she's dropping respect for him. Ouch. However, Miri Brown makes shocking decision about the future of her Utah bed and breakfast. Miri Brown is making headlines once again, but this time it's not just about her personal life, she's taking a dramatic step with her business. After ending her tumultuous marriage to Cody Brown, Miri has decided to part ways with her cherished Parowan Utah bed and breakfast, Lizzie's Heritage Inn. And this isn't just any ordinary sale, Miri's dropping a major bombshell that has fans buzzing. Why Mary is closing her bed and breakfast? The big news was unveiled on the Lizzie's Heritage Inn Facebook page with a bittersweet message, time to say goodbye. If only for a moment, Mary announced that she will be selling the inn, putting an indefinite pause on its operations. This beautiful 154-year-old home is in need of some TLC and needs some renovation, she explained. So I've made the decision to shut down the B&B &B for regular visits. While the inn will not be available for regular stays, Miri is planning to host special events in the future where visitors can still experience the property. Information about these exclusive events will be shared on the Lizzie's Heritage Inn website. This decision follows a year of major changes in Mary's life. After officially ending her 33-year marriage to Cody, she's choosing to move forward with new plans. It's worth noting that Mary isn't the only one leaving Cody behind. Three out of his four wives have parted ways with him, and rumors are swirling that his current marriage to Robin Brown might be facing difficulties, with speculation that she could be the next to exit. The B&B &B has been Mary's her family for years. Mary originally purchased Lizzie's Heritage Inn in December 2017, a purchase she made on her own after Cody and his family declined to support her financially, as seen on season 12 of Sister Wives. The historic inn, built by her great-great-grandparents in 1870, had been in her family until it was sold in the 1980s. Miri had previously renovated Lizzie's Heritage Inn, but now she's decided to sell it. Fans might remember that the inn was briefly closed in 2021 following the death of her mother, Bonnie Alstrom, who had been managing the property. Miri reopened it two months later, determined to continue the family legacy despite the loss. With the upcoming premiere of season 19 of Sister Wives on September 15, viewers are keen to see how Mary's life and business decisions play out. As she steps away from Lizzie's Heritage Inn, it's clear that Mary is embracing a new chapter with bold changes on the horizon, which will likely all play out on reality TV. However, Sister Wives, is Cody and Robin Brown's marriage doomed? Why the couple is turning on each other? Despite being Cody Brown's last wife standing, Robin Brown seems to have reached her tipping point, with the sister wives couple seemingly hitting their all-time low. Cody and Robin are still legally married after Christine Brown split from Cody in 2021, followed by Janelle Brown, who made her exit in 2022. Christine and Janelle's departure from the family motivated Mary Brown to end her union with the family patriarch in 2023. 
Nonetheless, between Cody's feud with his older kids, dealing with divorces and online hate, the family patriarch has ensured his relationship with Royan has remained unharmed. The sister-wives couple pushed the other wives and kids away, hoping to get there happily ever after. However, cracks started to show in Cody and Robin's relationship as soon as all the sister wives were gone. Robin began to express her dissatisfaction with Cody. He was no longer the man she desired. She no longer got the love and attention that Cody explicitly reserved for her. Also, Robin didn't put Cody on a pedestal like she used to, leaving him frustrated. Regretfully, Robin and Cody seemed to have more problems with the two constantly complaining about each other. Cody and Robin no longer have scapegoats. They are the agents of chaos. Robin always got preferential treatment. While Cody caused massive chaos among his first three wives, he ensured Robin felt valued and appreciated. Instead of sharing his time equally among all families, Cody would spend more time with Robin. At different times, Cody and Robin blamed Mary, Christine, and Janelle for all their shortcomings in the plural marriage. For instance, during the Sister Wives season 17 Tell All, Robin referred to herself as Cody's whipping boy, adding that the other wives would blame her whenever Cody did something they didn't like. During that reunion, the mother of five claimed that she was an easy target since she couldn't fight. In Robin's mind, she has always been a victim. In her admission, the Sister Wives star said she was wrongfully accused of causing drama. Cody has also adopted Robin's victim mentality and has never taken any responsibility for his failed marriages. While Cody often preached positive things about plural marriages, including his famous line, love should be multiplied, not divided, he fell in love with one wife, leaving the others neglected. Yet, after Christine and Janelle left, Cody blamed them for his strained relationship with his kids. Since Cody and Robin got used to shifting blame elsewhere, they never learned to take accountability for their actions. With their scapegoats out of the picture, the only thing the sister-wives couple can do is blame each other when things don't work in their marriage. Robin lacks contentment in her marriage. She is never satisfied. In the Sister Wives season 19 teaser, Robin accused Cody of sabotaging their marriage. Later, she said she felt like the idiot who got left behind. That sounded pretty ironic for someone who claimed to speak Cody. She strategically worked her way up to become Cody's favorite wife. That involved not questioning his rules and always treating Cody like a king. Once Robin boosted Cody's ego, there was no turning back for the narcissistic, selfish family patriarch who felt Mary, Janelle, and Christine should glorify him too. Robin so badly wanted Cody to herself despite repeatedly stating she was in the marriage for sisterhood. After being in a monogamous relationship with Cody, his true colors have started to show, making Robin realize that's not what she signed up for. Robin fully understood the extent of physical, emotional, and mental abuse Cody took the OG wives through what still stood by him. She must have discovered Cody wasn't the prize she thought he was and now wants out. Robin could have seen how independent-minded, happy, and free the three sister wives OGs are and wants that. Christine is happily married to David Woolley, and Janelle enjoys her freedom after leaving the polygamous marriage. On the other hand, Mary is also doing pretty well with Cody out of the equation. Robin is tired of Cody constantly whining to her. Cody complains a lot. Cody has to be the biggest complainer in reality television history. He pouts when things don't go his way. When Sister Wives began, Cody came across as a loving family man who was kind and patient to all his four wives. He spoke softly to them and seemed to listen. However, as Sister Wives progresses, the once considerate husband becomes irritable and unable to forgive his wives even for the slightest mistakes. In Sister Wives season 19, he's still blaming his wives for leaving and calls it a betrayal via TLC. They have all betrayed me. In Cody's mind, he could do no wrong, and if his children and wives felt any negativity, it was their fault, not his. Although Robin worked so hard to be Cody's best customer, she now has to deal with him alone, which has been a lot of work. Cody is incapable of loving anyone else but him. Therefore, Robin must have realized this as the sister-wives couple tried a monogamous marriage and no longer enjoyed being around him. The only punching bag that Cody has is Robin, who is growing weary of him each passing day. Will Cody and Robin split one day? It doesn't seem like it. 
Robin and Cody are not living the monogamous bliss they envisioned. Their marriage was built on the two blaming everyone else for their shortcomings. With Mary, Janelle, and Christine gone, they started to point fingers at one another while trying to adjust to the new norm. Nevertheless, there is no other divorce on the horizon for Cody. They are meant for each other, in a toxic way. Robin is Cody's soulmate and was his trophy wife when the other wives were still part of their union. It is the reason why she comfortably watched Cody wallow in self-pity and destroy decades of long-term relationships he had with his other wives. During Sister Wives, one-on-one -on -one special in December 2023, Cody admitted that he and Robin had agreed not to drag each other out if they fell out of love. Despite their supposed marital discord, which the couple is experiencing in Sister Wives season 19, Cody and Robin will not divorce unless he brings a younger wife on board. Therefore, Robin is still using her victim card to look more relatable. Soon enough, Sister Wives viewers will see how far Cody and Robin will go in painting themselves as victims as they try to avoid being villainized this season. Hello lovely viewers, welcome to my channel. I am Sabrina, hope your day is so well. If you liked the video, don't forget to subscribe to the channel.